Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Here we are going to be doing a special side quest where we are going to be getting our very first weapon. So let's find out what it's all about. You're here, good. Ready to get working on the resistance weapons last? Please know that upon completing the quest, Fire in the Forge, you will receive a resistance weapon for a dark knight. Yes, we'll undertake this quest as a dark knight. Fire in the forge. Geralt looks ready to fire up his forge. You like the name Resistance Weapon? It crossed my mind to call them Gunhilder's Blades, but after talking with Mistletoe, we figured it'd be too confusing, seeing as how that's also the name of the Queen's Guard. Andy Rowe, your timing couldn't be better. Before we get to working in earnest, I was hoping you could tell me a bit more about what went on in Sid's noggin. I've heard a fair bit from Makoto, but I'd like to know if you saw any difference. Hmm, sounds like I was right to ask you before setting to work. Seems to me those fancy markings in the weapons are mainly for show. I can copy them, I, but that won't be enough. Like as not, they were carved into the hilts as well. And to make sure the spell can take hold, you'll need a finish with fine powder what's conductive to eat them. For material like that, I reckon you need to consult with the alchemist of Razat Han. Ugh, and I can think of only one person with close contacts there. Oh god, you don't mean... Aye, the demoness of coin. Bet not to worry, lass. It just so happens she's been keeping up a steady shipment of supplies here on contract. If we say we need the powder for resistance, it might be as well we can convince her to waive the cost. She ain't usually one to do business for charity, I know, but it's worth a try, eh? I see about getting in touch with her, and after I do, you can go and meet up with her and figure out the rest. Well, you don't expect me to go and meet with her, do ye? Working on the resistance weapons keep me busy by half, and Drake here, er, I mean, uh, what was your name again? Zanatan, Master Geralt. My name is Zanatan. But more importantly, what if Mistress Rowena doesn't agree to the charitable contribution to our cause? I'm sure if you and Basilegion asked her nicely, she might come around. But never mind that, we've important work to do. As for where you find Rowena, before she left Gango, she said she's been stopping over at Kugane on business. How about I have her meet you at the Amakilo Tea House? If we're lucky, a nice cup of tea will brighten her mood. Ooh, look at that! Resistance Weapon, the saga of Grunhilder's Blades. Alright, let's head over to Kugani. Now, I actually heard that getting the weapons isn't too difficult. You just need a lot of tombstones of poetics to be able to do it, and we've got plenty of that. So we're going to see just how difficult it's going to be to get just one weapon. And if it's as easy as they say it is, and I have a feeling it is, then we'll probably go on and do all the rest too. But for now, we're just going to start off with the Dark Knight. And we'll see how difficult it is from there. Honestly, I was expecting it to be kind of like with Eureka. Like, we'd have to run around this crazy area and work super super hard just trying to level up our weapons oh boy that's brutal just thinking about it I still have painful memories of the last weapons like series we had to do okay let's see where she is I was wondering when you'd show up Gerald told me everything And luckily for you, my business here was at the Thavnarian Consulate. Here you are. This should be enough powder for one of those resistance weapons you're forging. I've got to hand it to Gerald. Seems he spends half his time getting deeper in debt, and the other half avoiding payment. Fine by me, though. Thanks to his scheming, I have a little more leverage over the resistance, and, by extension, him as well. Pass along a message to Geralt and Basilingian for me, won't you? If they require more materials for these weapons, I'd be more than happy to supply them. 
for a fee, of course. Same goes for you. I know you adventuring types are always looking to be prepared for any sort of encounter, so if you're thinking of forging another of those resistance weapons, and I suspect you are, you know where to go. I'll see to it my girls in Revenant's Toll and Idleshire keep their shelves stocked. Until next time. Yeah, something tells me she's never gonna let your all go. Then again, I don't think either of them are too upset by this, at least judging from what we saw before. And, you know, I think that this whole little back and forth between them is probably gonna last the rest of their lives, if not for all eternity. Like, I'm saying, like, even in the next lifetime. She, he's probably still gonna owe her something. <laughs> and that's not including the interest. Alright, so here we go. Now, I was told that to get the special kind of sand that we need to complete these quests, we first have to go over either to Mordona or to Idleshire and we can get it from there. That's kind of the what I've heard from everyone else talking about it though while we were in Gangos. So I'm sure we'll find out more about that later on, but for now, let's just see what the next weapon's going to look like. I can't wait to see what it looks like. Oh man, what's with these loading screens? They seem to be taking so much time up. There we go. Okay, we're back. Yeah, we're having a lot of people just shouting out what the weapons are so that we actually get a good look at what they look like. Okay, so this is it, the scale powder. The weapon's nearly finished, Claire. Just needs a nice coating with that powder to finish the inscription. Of course, she bloody found what we needed. As much as I hate fattening her purse with another man's coin, at least now we can do our part for the resistance. Feast your eyes and some of me finest work to date. Best of all, the inscription will react to your ether. A fright fine weapon to rally the Bosians. Woeborn. I reckon Gruhilder be proud. That I should behold the glory of the fabled blades born anew. Hope is not yet lost. All in a day's work for your old pal Geralt. Of course, this is only the beginning. Your skills with the hammer were truly a sight to behold, Master Geralt, and to see Claire wielding one of their holy blades thus, it is as if I stand before one of the heroes of Eld. When that time comes to do battle with the Empire, our brothers in arms will look upon you and no courage. On behalf of the Bojan resistance, I offer you my humblest thanks for your aid thus far. I love to start fresh on another weapon, but I had to use every last morsel of the powder on that one. Meaning we would find ourselves indebted further to Mistress Rowena were we to acquire more. I must consult Basil and Jen before we proceed further. Looks like we're taking a short break then, eh? If you find yourself wanting for another weapon though, come and speak with me helper here. I think I earned myself a nice big flagon of ale tonight to uh, celebrate the forging, of course. All right, that was easy. Okay, the repeatable quest is now available. Okay, so the quest may attempt it. Okay, please ensure that you change your desired job before speaking with them. Right, so here it is. The scale powder can now be purchased from Uriana from Revenant's Toll or Himishia at Idleshire. Does this mean we have a nice new title? I doubt it. 
But it won't hurt just to double check. No? Oh well. I'm not too upset. I need to clear this out anyway. Alright! Yep, clearly the superior model. Ah, oh, cool! Look at it, it even glows! That is something to be scared of if you see it waving at you in battle. Alright everyone, looks like we're going to be accepting the next quest soon enough. So until then everyone, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you all enjoyed it. And I will be going through each and every single one of the other jobs just to see what each of these weapons looks like. So I'm probably going to do a whole video just showing off what the weapons are going to be, but that might take a while. So until next time, everyone, thank you so much for watching, and I hope that you all have a great rest of your day, and you're looking forward to completing all the rest of the weapons here. It's probably going to take a while. So until then, everyone, take care, bye-bye, and try not to let quarantine get you down. Take care.